Hello and welcome back to Scrap Mechanic. I'm Ruka from Honey Bunny Games and in the last episode we started with this garage door and I had some issues. I kinda made this off camera. So let me show you this thing. Okay, look at this beauty. I should have probably go with more steps, but eh, it's fine. Oh my god, I love it. Uh, I didn't actually quite think I'm gonna be able to make it, but the thing is I took some Legos, <laughs> made this door, well, the concept of this door, and uh, to see how this thing will have to work. So basically I came up with something like, uh, I cannot access the controller. Uh, I have the sorting uh, right next to the garage on the outside so I can have both switches for this thing. I have this sensor here which I'm going to implement this episode. So here we go, we take a piston a little bit out, rotate the, the first part of the first segment of the door, then take the piston a little bit more out, rotate the second segment and all the way to the bottom. But right now, uh, let me open the door just to show, nah, I don't need to show you the source thing. But the thing is, when this garage is open, uh, this lift will basically get stuck. Oh, I should not have done that. Um, so yeah, you can see it will get stuck. That's not good. That's not something we want. But I want this size and I want this garage door to be this size. So I'm going to close the door, lower the lift and implement the sensor. So I'm going to place the sensor right about here. I'm going to get up. Oh no, wrong button. But anyway, the sensor should light up. Okay, I'm going up. Uh, yeah, I didn't want to fall down. Okay, now when I flip the switch, if I can... There you go, this thing is... Oh, this thing is not actually working as I thought it would be. Um, okay, I'm going to place the sensor here. See? Oh, here. Uh, and can I actually target the... Yes, I can. This thing is active and once the door is kind of closed, a little bit more, it should deactivate itself. Or maybe not. Oh well, doesn't matter. But this guy should not be able to lift upward uh, while this sensor is active. So we're gonna place a simple AND gate. Just going to... No. Okay, maybe actually that was right. Just gonna place this thing. Okay. And of course, uh, I'm gonna close this thing up. As you can see, it's not perfectly well stable. It's kind of hanging on this side. That's because well, the piston is in a corner. That's not actually quite good. Is the garage door closed? Yes, it is. So let us lower down the lift. And let's go outside. I think I started. I did not start. Okay, I'm gonna start making a second uh, end thing actually. Not exhorting. So basically, it's not a second, it's a first end thing here. And, well, yeah, we're gonna connect end logic. Here, Lego Worlds has posted a new announcement, announcement update, blah blah blah, something is live, nice, whatever that is. Okay, so I'm going to place the, what was I going to place? Oh, the end gate. Um, I'm gonna try and go with a different design than I have in the, in the tutorial. So let me see, let me see, let me see. I did see some guy, someone actually left a comment about him. So I'm gonna go with something like that. But let me see, how does the logic table work for 
and gates uh, let me quickly draw it out like zero 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 one okay so once the both guys are active um can i make it like this i'm not sure actually i'm thinking of something like each of these sides uh falling down something like the or gate i made but i'm not sure if i'm gonna be able to do it uh okay so we're gonna go with this thing um okay there we go um yeah actually i'm gonna use this thing uh gonna need two controllers one here turn blue 90 blue 90 and this guy no 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 that's not gonna work uh i had another idea oh yeah this one bam and bam and oopsie not here but here Okay, so this thing will turn blue 45. Oopsie. Blue 45. Well, this guy also has to turn blue 45. Let me just quickly test this thing. And also gonna place the thing. And disable the sensor so I cannot accidentally trigger it. Okay, I'm gonna connect this thing just to test if it works. Okay, doesn't work. Works fine, excellent. I'm uh, gonna delete these guys and well, connect this little fella to this thing. Disconnect this guy, connect him to this sensor. And connect this guy to this sense. Okay, no, 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 no. That's a mistake. Um, basically, let me see. Um, this guy has to be, yeah, this guy has to be, which one is it? This one? He has to be turned 45 all the time. But if it's activated, it will turn negative 45. So back in the starting position. Nah, yeah, exactly. So right now, if I do this. Yep, it's working. Okay, let's go down. What if this thing is opened? Can I do it now? Of course not. The only problem problem is if this thing is oh uh, no 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 let's close it down. Uh, let's go up as soon as this thing deactivates. Come on. There we go. The only problem is if lift is already up and you open the door. Yeah, it doesn't actually collide, but that might be a problem. So I'll probably have to go and do some state things. So if if it's in upper state, let's say it's true, then it shouldn't change while this is out. Something like that, but that's a whole nother level of logic. So not going to do it in this episode. I'm probably gonna have to test this thing out, make a tutorial so everybody can use it. But right now, that's not gonna happen. I want to close this thing down. And leave some holes. There we go. And maybe like this. I'm not sure why they did I just draw age, but doesn't matter. Here is a bit random pattern. But anyway, this is the garage with the two level thing so it works
Nice, nice, nice. Let's go up. Go, 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 go. Oh. Yeah. Let's go up. Nice. Oh, not nice. Uh, there we go. Now it's nice. Uh, just gonna finish this thing up. There we go. Nice beautiful garage. I could actually go further and place an ore gate here. I'm going to do that. Of course I'm going to do that. Okay, come on. I'm gonna leave somewhere about here. Okay. Like this. Okay, so one more ore gate. XOR gate, XOR, that is. Oh, I didn't close this thing actually. Quite good. Um, oh, yeah, I could do something like this. Oh, nice. Um, what was I going to do? Oh, yeah, XOR gate. Uh, sorry, haha. <laughs> uh, okay, bad pun. Um, let me make this thing like this. Same here. Gonna get deleted. You. Oh, oh, wrong deletion. Uh, okay, also gonna have a sensor here. Like this, two controllers. Actually, I'm not gonna place them so close to this thing. I said two controllers. Connect each one like this. Um, actually gonna do something like this. So this guy will go into this thing. This guy will go into this thing. Um, and let's see, the, this guy has to rotate positive, let's say 50. And this guy has to go negative, let's say 50. Okay, I think I know for a fact I'm gonna have to increase the distance on this thing and let's try it out. Okay, this thing works, that's fine. What about the other way around? Oh, it has to go even further. Okay. Plus 55. Plus 60. There we go. That's it. That's it for this garage. It's, I think, there's nothing else we could add. We can activate this on, in both things. Uh, it's locked, so it doesn't open while this door is opened. There, I'm just gonna lower it down. Okay, come on, come on, come on, come on. Let's open the door. And go outside. There we go. We have a nice little garage. I mean, it's not nice, but the concept is here. So, yeah, this is it. In the next episode, I'm not sure if I'm gonna continue on this save or something else. I might start with a factory or some other few ideas I had in my mind. Um, I know you guys are su suggesting a lot, but the, the first thing I'm going to tell you is I'm probably not ever gonna do any vehicles because that's just not my thing. Uh, but these cool contraptions, definitely up to. So in the next episode, I'll probably think of something awesome, or maybe not so awesome, but something and build it. But right now, this will be it. So thank you guys for watching. Please subscribe, leave a comment, like the video, and see you next time.